2020 has been, you know, a year like no other. I, I would say in my life and in so many others, we've had so many losses, so many stories. And as we stand here in front of Greenfield Cemetery, a cemetery owned by the town of Hempstead, we've seen a lot of pain. We've seen a lot of heartache. Uh, a year where we averaged maybe two to three funerals a day uh, in April and late March and even into May, we were seeing in the 20s of burials in this facility. And, and this is a really special cemetery because it is owned by the town and it's much more affordable for a lot of families. Um, the cost is, is roughly almost half for to bury somebody here than it would be at, at other facilities. And that's why this is a really important facility. But it's because of a resident's idea, a resident's concept that we are happy to make a major announcement today. You know, because of, of, of Deborah Salant's idea, where she reached out to the town board and explained her circumstance of having a plot here, but having no family members. And she wanted to help families who lost loved ones in 2020 because of COVID-19, but didn't have the means to bury them, let it be financial or availability. Because of her idea, the town board has now adopted a policy for families who have plots here that want to donate them to families of victims of COVID that have passed away. We are going to be able to do that. And what other way can we help, especially during the holiday time, than to help those who really need our help? And this could not be done without the town board, and I am so grateful for their taking the time to get involved and to read my heartfelt request that a change be made in this cemetery. Hopefully, maybe perhaps next year, we will have crossed that area where the COVID patient death total will be going down. But we don't know what the future holds. We never expected this to happen. And if we all pull together and we reach out and we talk to our neighbors, our friends, our loved ones, perhaps someone else has a grave that they'd like to donate. And by making that donation, we're helping ease the pain of a loved one's family. Like the supervisor mentioned, during the height of the pandemic, I remember sitting in our conference room with him and a few others on the phone with the administration here at the cemetery. And they were dealing with days that they have never seen. And the toll, both physical and emotional, that has been taken on those that work here they should really be applauded because they are unsung heroes of this pandemic. And I also finally want to thank the supervisor for his leadership uh, in this situation and during this pandemic. Like he mentioned, we are ending the year of 2020 in less than a month, but unfortunately, the pandemic is here to stay. We're looking for something different. We're looking for those blessings from way back when. We're looking for the Christmas miracles. And through generosity of Deborah and her family, we're going to make it right. We're going to keep the blessings alive. I'm just hoping that we get, and I was thinking today, I, I don't think we can get enough Christmas snow to make this feel like Christmas. But due to the Hanukkah season, I think we're on our way for the good things that Deborah has given us today. Thank you. I tell you, we, uh, we felt it right here. And of course, it was unanimous. Everybody voted in favor of it because it's such an incredible, what a what a a, a wonderful thing to do. So, uh, like my colleagues, I wish those a happy Hanukkah. And you're making a few people happy that they have a place to rest close to home. Thank you and God bless. 2020 um, has just been so many downsides, so much loss. Um, it's nice that. We find a, 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 you know, a light in this storm with the good thoughts and the good, the good grace and, and the big heart that you are bringing here today, Deborah. And I want to, again, thank you on behalf of everybody that's going to be able to benefit and say goodbye to a loved one. I want to say thank you for bringing a wonderful idea to the town board. Uh, and, and, and I can't stress enough um, the appreciation we really have because this, this is due to you. 
and you deserve all the credit in the world, and that's the only person that should get it. So thank you very, very much. Well